Welcome to Tales from the Potting Shed and today we're doing an update video on the um, see-through vegetable garden. <laughs> two to three weeks now since I planted uh, the uh, nine seeds there were in total, no ten seeds there were in total I think I did. Uh, I did spring onions, carrots and radishes. Um, so what's happened in those three weeks? Well first of all da -da -da -da, we got a radish, we got a radish, there you are, get in camera radish. Right so basically we've had a breakthrough on the radish nothing else has come through. Uh, it has been indoors, it's been in the potting shed uh, since I did it. But what I want to point out is, whilst we turn it round, there's nothing to see at the front, but if I turn it around, da -da 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 -da, look down there. There's definitely, where's my finger, there is definitely something coming, happening down here, which is near the carrot sign. So I'm assuming there's some sort of root going on with the carrot. So, you know, I'm not sure if that is a good thing. <laughs> no, it must be a good thing. And I think if you look closely, it looks like there's other sort of roots, I think, um, starting to show. Um, yeah, I, I'm really uh, hoping that something is going to work on this. Not a lot to show on it after a, a couple of weeks, or well, pretty much nearly three weeks, I think, uh, since I did it. Just thinking, yeah, it should be about three weeks since I planted it. Nothing a lot showing, but at least we have some life, certainly down there, and then obviously up there with, behind the sign, the little um, radish that's coming through. Anyway, that's it for now. Just a quick update on the see-through vegetable garden. Uh, which I got from B&M for £5. Thanks for watching.